Take me. Save me from this place. Take me, Chromie. I'm ready. Yo, 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 yo! I'm back with a Snowblind video. It's not necessarily a caster build. I'm gonna try to get to work though as a caster build because I don't like playing hybrids. I don't like hybrids. Give me the diesel. Couple hiccups with this build. The main re that I wanted to try does not work with the legendary, so unfortunate. Also, thanks everybody for watching. I know you DPS monsters out there are ready to start pumping, but guess what? Pump that subscribe button. <laughs> Pump your 10K DPS right into that subscribe button. The Discord is very fresh, but it link to join is in the description so come on by maybe we'll start a guild do some ascended that'd be a lot of fun so we're gonna try out snowblind snowblind transforms your blizzard into ice prism which then is just a dot that increases the chance to be critically hit by holy spells by six percent and uh, dealing damage with a uh, cone or frostbolt is gonna refresh the dot all criticals on the target with the ice prism do this explosion um, that scales with cone of cold modifiers and also can proc surge of light which is the instant cast smite smite damage and cone of cold modifiers is, is the route I'm taking right now, I was working with Glacial Spike here. This is bad. Don't do it. Um, stay away from this. <clears throat> My plan here is to try out Snowblind as a caster. Um, I have seen builds as a hybrid DPS, basically Rep Pally that triggers Surge of Lights, and it seems to be doing well. The only mandatory epic re I see here is Swift Justice, which the baseline talent of Surge of Lights says that you can't crit with this uh, proc ability. So basically this epic re is, is saying you can, and it gives you a little buff of haste too, which is nice. That is the plan. Surge of light is the goal. Holy fire I need. Let's go. 69 on the board. Starting off strong. Uh, I don't need any of these though. I do have chicken, so I'll be a holy, uh, holy ice chicken. Okay, Succubus, get the fuck out of my way. What is going on here? Sort of little shindig is... What is it? Going around the corner. I don't know what's going on in there. There's Holy Fire. Yes! I didn't even really register because I'm, I'm so used to not looking for it. Avenging Wrath. Increase all holy damage cause. We'll take that. Yes by flame strike last one and shockwave ass we got the holy fire i'm going to try a couple parses on some dummies here holy fire on cooldown and spam smite right that's all i do so it looks like about 2k deeps not great okay two and a half we're pumping this is with a 117 eye level this is going to be um similar i'm going to be up close with kona cold and same same thing just kind of fishing for crits here Kona Colding on cooldown. I would say mediocre. Um, so I think this is a full smite investment build, which I think there are better smite builds. So I don't know why you'd take Snowblind as a caster. It's just smite spam with explosions. All right, it actually doesn't feel that bad in dungeons, DPS wise, and I might just need more gear. I mean, I am doing tank level damage. All right, boom, boom. Boom, 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 boom. Yeah. I think I just need a lot more crit. I'm at 45% crit. Okay. I just need 100% crit. I'll waste a prestige so you don't have to. Let's just put it that way. It's a uh, mediocre. I could, I could definitely see how the hybrid version is way better. Because you're proccing instead of with smite cast you're proccing with divine storm crusader strike any holy damage ability caster snow blind put it in the trash caster builds better than snow blind uh everything else for smite spam holy ascension twilight paragon take one of those if you want to go frost frost bomb ice barrage also solid i knew i should have tried evoker i was between evoker and this on this prestige and goodbye should have went with it she in my heart, not my gut. The AoE that's modified with Kona Cold, the Shatter, it needs to scale with Holy Damage in order for this to work. There's honestly no reason it shouldn't scale with Holy Damage. The dual element builds just don't have the same sort of punch as like Pure Shadow or just going full Holy. Like this little limp dick going into Frost thing is just not, not working. And I'm sure there's many other builds like that. 
I felt similar with Frozen Chaos, though Frozen Chaos was leaps and bounds better than this. Bill didn't work out this time. That's fine. That means there's only one thing left to do. Take me away, Chromie! Take me, save me from this place. 